Happening today, Texas Southern University is breaking ground on a new facility that will help alleviate a critical pilot shortage. Yeah, and senior digital producer Brittany Wilmore live in the newsroom taking off with this information. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I like that. I need my little pilot's That's hat right. on. <laughs> well, the groundbreaking for the Texas Southern University Flight Academy at Ellington Airport is at 11 a.m., but construction won't start until the, on the facility until next May, and it's not expected to be completed until the following year in May 2025. This morning, we're getting an idea, though, of what it'll all look like. The two acre facility will feature a 22,000 square foot aircraft hangar, plus training and classroom space in a 12,000 gallon above ground aviation fuel tank. It'll sit on a portion of land accessible to an existing taxi lane connection. The project is moving forward after city council approved an agreement between the Houston airport system and TSU earlier this year. Now, TSU is the only university in the state that offers a four-year aviation degree. It's also the only historically black college and university, or HBCU, in the country that has flight simulation programs. On top of that, in July, it became the second HBCU to receive one of the highest levels of recognition in aviation for its program, and it's growing. The school recently told our partners at the Houston Chronicle 156 students were enrolled this fall, with 73 of those wanting to become pilots. That's important because the need for pilots is expected to grow by 13 percent over the decade after the pandemic forced many to leave the business and that means delays and cancellations. I think we're going to see the airlines start to really invest um, in, in our youth. Now more than ever is the best time to start your training and make your way into the flight deck. Well, you just heard from a couple of United pilots. United alone has a major hub here in Houston and wants to hire 10,000 pilots by the year 2030. So the need is definitely there. Again, if you're interested, the Bureau of Labor Statistics says the average salary for a pilot is more than $130,000. Live in the newsroom, I'm Brittany Wilmore. Back to you. Oh, baby.